Cubase. Cubase. So here we are in Cubase, and I want to show you how you can make sure that all of the loops and samples that you bring into your project match your project tempo, and then stay in sync if you happen to change your tempo. So let's go into the media pool over here. If you don't see this tab, uh, you might need to um, click this button right here, and it reveals uh, your media pool right here. We're going to go into the content that ships with... Um, with Cubase, and let's go into our uh, let's go into our loops library here. We got beats selected. Actually, let's go back and select the beats. Make sure that we're just getting a little drum beat here going right here. Okay, so let's. Uh, and if you select this and you don't hear anything, that means that you, the first thing you need to do is you need to hit the auto play uh, new results selection. So as you can hear, things are starting to play. So. So by default, um, so I have my project tempo set to 100 BPM. By default, if I bring this into uh, the project here, you can kind of see right away that things don't uh, look the way that they should. So if I hit play now, so you can hear right away. So this is playing back at 100 BPM. Uh, I'm sorry, this is playing back at its native 150 BPM. And my project is 100 BPM. And if you can hear that click, uh, you can tell right away it's off. So how do we fix that? So the way that we fix it, let's go ahead and undo this. Let's undo that and we fix that. So now if I hit, so this is 150 BPM, right? Okay, so let's click that button right there. Align beats to project. So now everything is playing back, no matter which one I select here, everything is playing back at 100 BPM, which is the project tempo. So if I drag this in here, look at that. It comes in, uh, it comes in at my, um, at my project tempo. Okay, let's find another beat here. Okay, let's bring that in. There we go. So this also works with uh, your own samples as well too. So let me go ahead and show you how that works. I'm gonna go back to the media pool here. Let's click on file browser here. And I have a, uh, I have a sample pack right here um, that uh, this is the tempo of this is 106 BPM, but it's playing back at 100 BPM, which is my project tempo. So I'm actually going to change my project tempo to 90. And you can tell as soon as I make another selection that it changes the uh, changes to the project tempo. So let's go ahead and drag this in right here. And uh, let's go ahead and play back. So there you go. So if you got value out of this video, I would appreciate it if you gave me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you have not already, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye for now.